Jacko, we travel down to uh, Cambridge on Saturday. Yeah. Is this a chance for us to respond from, from Saturday's game? Yeah, well, obviously we're disappointed at the weekend, but we've got to try and just move on from that now. We'll learn the lessons from it, know where we need to improve. And we're looking, we're looking forward now. We've had a good week's training. We've had the group in, some lads have got started to come back who've just joined us, getting fitter. So there's been some positives this week. But it, don't get me wrong, it, it hurt last week. You know, it hurts everybody and all the fans, the players and myself. So we're looking now to react and respond from that. And that's important, isn't it? Taking that pain of what, how we felt after the final whistle on Saturday and using that energy towards this weekend's game. Yes, definitely. I think you've got to, as a team, I think you'd be always identified as how you react from them situations. I think that says a lot about players, managers, characters, teams. I think that will always be the way. So our thing now is make sure we react in the right way and attack everything, every moment that we can. It's important to remember as we're only two games into the season, there's a lot, of, a lot more football matches to play, a lot more points as well. Yes, there is. There is, and that you can. We've looked at it and gone where we've gone wrong and what we can do better. But there is. But at the end of the day, you still want to win those games. You know, we we're, we know there's a lot of games to play, but we have we try and set high standards where. We don't look at it like that, well, we're all right, it's the next game. We wanted to do our very best at that in that moment in time. We know there's areas that we didn't we didn't do well in that game, but we've learned from them. If you give you, if you give daft goals away early on in games, then you're gonna give yourself an uphill struggle. So that's what we did. But the group know that and like I said, they're hurting and they're they're looking to react. And this is a new group as well that's come together, eight yeah. and nine new faces. So they are getting still used to each other, and you can see the improvements going in different areas of play. No, definitely, that's a great point. Again, we've got, like you said, eight and nine players coming in. A lot of them are in them uh, attacking areas as well, which we're trying to get at this moment in time. I'm trying to get them connections between those players, and it and it takes it does take time. But we'll work. All I can say is we're working really hard to try and do that. So are the players, and I've seen a response in training this week from them. They're getting another week fitter another week in with the group and the group wants to do well. And you can tell just on the mood on the training camp and how the lads are you know are training they look up for Saturday don't they? There's a good vibe about the place. Yeah there is like I said I think I think we've got we've got to learn as a group that people want to try and beat Tramir. You know they, they want they want to scalp. So we've got to be ready for that sort of thing. And I think the group I've learned that now I think I think the first three games we were where we needed to be in terms of being solid and sound, and but we've come away from that a little bit. I think you've got to realise, and, and the boys know that, that you've got to be first and foremost. You've got to be hard to beat in these games. You've got to earn the right to play and compete all the time. It never changes. The game won't stand still for you. It won't be the game that you always want, but you've got to do that. Well, the positives that you've had now from being a week game this week, so a full week of training for the likes of Kim Muller and Liam Feeney who joined the group a couple of weeks ago. Yeah, it's been great. It's been good to have another week's training. Again, it, like I said, it gets them another week fitter. It gets the group another week fitter. And it gives you a chance, again, like you said, with them new players coming in, to get those ideas over and, and, and get the repetitiveness in them that you need to get them all gelling together. And looking ahead to uh, this weekend's opponents, Cambridge United, they've started the season well. Um, so it'll be a tough test one, like every game, isn't it? Yeah. Season? You said, you said it there, it's, they all, they're all tough tests, they've started well, like I said always about uh, teams that we play against, I always respect the manager and, and the team that we play, but we know how they play, we know what we need to be good at, and I know you can say you keep saying that, but you do, we know the areas in this in this league and in this game and in all games of football, the areas we've got to really attack, so we're, we're going down there fully focused, wanting to do well. Good luck. No problem, thank you.